Hi guys, I'm Ashish from Guiding Tech and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can open any of the external link without actually leaving the app using a very nifty application called Flinks. So let's get started and see how that's done. Now the very first thing that we need to do is uh, install the Flinks floating browser still in beta state from the Play Store. Now the app is free to use and uh, once you install it you can directly go ahead and start using it. So let's say for example um, I have Google now and I want to open a web link. Let's see the release date of this uh, iPhone uh, iOS 8. So I'm just gonna tap on it and it will ask me to complete the action now as I have installed a new browser it will ask me for a confirmation so uh, let me just click on uh, for once you can but you can all if, if you get familiar to fling you can uh, select the always option now as you can see that uh, the browser will show me a status bar uh, a blue color status bar around this floating icon and it, it shows that the page is loading in the background and then and that I can go ahead and browse any more information uh, on the device that I want to. Now once you see the five icon of that particular uh, website you can just tap on it to open the web page. Now you can uh, just like any other browser you can uh, swipe in to zoom in swipe out and basically every other stuff that you want to do. Now here's the thing uh, a cool thing about the app actually now <laughs> here is a reading mode which will actually load the page in a reading mode so that I don't uh, with the word wrap feature and also that I don't need to swipe in and out whenever I <coughs> if I have uh, too much of uh, data to read on here is a text size that I can increase and decrease a night feature and it does save uh, your battery life uh, trust me on if you have uh, if you're reading on for a long time now you can also uh, manage multiple links you know, using this app uh, at max you can open uh, around four lips uh, yes four tabs side by side so as you can see that I have uh, two written over there which means that I have two tabs that are open concurrently using flink and as uh, just like uh, the last one it showed me a status bar now once I tap on it I get both my tab side by side and I can open it using it in here also I can activate the read feature and it will load from the server the uh, text that I can uh, easily read through now if you want to close this particular browser you just need to tap it and drag it to the close button at the bottom of the screen and this feature is very similar to what we get in Facebook chats overheads while chat uh, while the messen from the messenger app now if you open the flink uh, app you'll see a browsing history that uh, you can use to actually see all the website that you have open using the browser in the settings menu you can change the bubble size that uh, is actually that you see on the screen on the edges of the screen and you can also select a secondary browser if at all you want to open a new tab on uh, not using the fling but using your secondary browser so yes that was pretty much everything about the app and it is really very useful once uh, if you if like if you are a twitter buff or on facebook or on any like whatsapp if you have to open multiple links and that you don't want to actually leave the app while uh, you wait for the page to load if you have any doubts about this app do ask uh, them in the comment section do subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and if you really like the video don't forget to press the thumbs up button it was Ashish from guiding tech and thank you for watching the video